So my name is Rachel Hicks. I am a third semester medical student here at SEBA. And before I came to SEBA, I was a registered nurse in the emergency room for three years. I really enjoyed nursing. It was really rewarding. You get to have a really intimate relationship with your patients because you see them your whole shift. I was actually on my pre-grad rotation in the intensive care unit for nursing. And one of the specialists, a nephrologist, was consulting on my case, and he actually graduated from SEBA. He really recommended SEBA as a good school, and it kind of gave me hope that I could get back into Canada after medical school. That was really what I was going for. On SEBA, I rented a two-bedroom apartment simply because my landlord didn't have a one-bedroom available, and I brought my cat, so <laughs> she allowed pets. I wake up every morning, the sun is rising over the ocean in my backyard. It's absolutely breathtaking. Right now I'm in third semester, so my course load includes neuroscience, mind and behavior, introduction to systems and diseases, and basic neurology. I'm also taking my third semester clinical skills course, which we're learning the skills to go along with neuroscience, mind and behavior. There is a pretty high level of interaction between students and faculty. The professors are more than willing to help you with anything, and they're willing to spend a fair amount of time with you to make sure that you understand things. You have to get used to just the type of life that you're going to live here. The internet describes SEBA as the unspoiled queen, and that's really exactly what it is. Coming from Canada, I wouldn't have imagined anything like this. There's probably four or five grocery stores. There's some boutiques and some places you can get clothing, some places for school supplies. They have all the essentials. The restaurants here are fabulous. I go to a local restaurant called Tropics. I happen to enjoy seafood and they present it very well. I'll probably end up going into a field in emergency neurology, like a stroke center, that kind of thing. I just have heart for emergency now that I've been there. I don't think I'll lose it. I think if you're considering pursuing medicine, it's a hard road, but the end result is rewarding. If you're considering SEBA, I would say you should go for it. If this is what you want to do with your life and you want to become a physician, SEBA is going to give you the opportunity to do that.